Good morning to you. Yeah, junk mail, John, is a £1 billion a year business in Britain. And we all get junk mail from time to time. But it does appear that if you answer one of them, you end up on what is horribly called a suckers list. And then you get more and more and more. Now, that is what happened to Lillian. At 79, in a period of less than a year, she got more than 10,000 letters. And here are just some of them here. In November, just 10 or 11 months after this started, Lillian died of a stroke and her family are convinced it was because of the stress of what she had to go through. And she did, as you said, spent £36,000 on replying to these and, of course, never got any of the prizes she was promised. Let me just talk you through some of these letters because they're just horrible. This one. The confirmed amount you're going to win is £35,000 as long as you send us a £20 payment fee and answer this very complicated sum. 10 plus 25, that was what she had to do. This one, she was promised a dream holiday if she sent £14.95 and so it goes on. In a period of just one day on the 27th of May, she made 24 payments to these companies. Eventually, she started writing on these letters, ran out of money. £30 needed, no money to send. And in this heartbreaking letter to one of the companies, she wrote, At the moment I am struggling, so that's why I'm writing this letter. I have no ready cash at all. Now, Lillian is now dead. Her family convinced that these letters led her to her death, John.